What? Oh my god! My life! What is going on? Hey girls and guys, it is Sarah from Sai. Let's play! We are back with another DIY kit. And this time it is not a slime kit. Oh no, no, no. So in the last videos and in all my slime videos, I always ask you guys what slime kit you would like me to review next. And a lot of you guys have been telling me to try out the Dojo Siwa Slime Kit. So I was on the interwebs, you know, searching, you know, trying to find it. And I found something that I thought, what was my phone? I can't even talk. It was so much more interesting. And that is the Jojo Siwa Hair Styling Kit. So not only do you get to make your own bow, but you got this little thing right here that you could dye your hair with and all this cool stuff. So I was like, I have to try it. I was a huge fan of Dance Moms. I remember when Jojo came on the show and when she left as well. So I was like, this is actually quite cool. Like forget about the bow and all that stuff. I am really interested to try out that little machine right there to find out if it's actually gonna work with my hair or not. As you can see, Jojo has blonde hair. The girl in the back, she's got like really light blondish hair as well. And then you have my hair, which is kind of like a brown, black mixture, you know? So I was kind of like, you know, let's see if it's gonna work on my hair. So I am here to let you guys know whether this kit right here will, you know, be worth it or not. Is it fun? Is it all that good stuff? So I think I paid about $14 for this on Amazon. So let's take you guys a little bit closer and see what is inside. So here we have the kit right here up close. So let's go ahead and open it up and see what is inside. So here we go. Let's take this out. All right, so here we go. We have everything that we need. So in this bag, we have our hair extensions that we're gonna get to use and our little side pony in the future. So right now, as you can see, it's just plain white, but we're gonna use the hair dye to go ahead and dye this different colors. We also have two different bow options. We have an all white one and a pink one. Let's see what else we have. We have the stencils here. So the stencils, I'm not sure if you guys will be able to see what they are, but there's hearts, there's little bows, there's cupcakes, cherries, rainbows, a lot of cool little different options. We've got the actual cool marker, maker, cool maker. That says maker, not marker, sorry. <laughs> so let's open that up. Okay, that was hard to open. So as you can see, we have our different colors here. We've got a pink, yellow, like a, it's almost like a mint or turquoise, blue and purple. This is gonna be the little clip that's gonna hold the bow together. I think this is like the hair clip that you use to put in your hair. We've got these two little stickers right here. And then of course we have the instructions. And here is the actual whoa. So here's a, oh my cat did not like that. She's like, what is that? And my dog's like, hmm. So here's a little contraption. So it did need batteries and it did not come with a battery. So you gotta make sure you have some batteries laying around. So there it is. That's what it sounds like. I think this is how you turn it on and off. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna read the instructions so I know exactly what I'm doing, and then I'll let you guys, you know, let, let you guys know what we're doing next. So I think I've got the hang of it. I'm gonna go ahead and put a piece of paper down because as you can see my art table's already, you know, it has enough paint on it. So we're gonna grab our little machine right here and we're gonna grab our first color. So I think I'm gonna start off with the plain white bow and we're gonna try to do something really cool with it and I'm thinking of a gradient. And I actually got in the inspiration from the box. So if you could see this right here on the Jojo name, you can see how it goes pink, purple, and blue, and then it kind of fades out to almost like a green. So that's kind of what I wanna do for my bow. So I'm gonna start off with, let's see, what color do we need first? We're gonna need this pink first. And the instructions seem pretty easy. So this is what the little, you know, like, I guess you could, I, I would just call it like a marker or like they call it a makeup stick. So that goes right in here in this little part. So I'm, I've already made sure that it's off. And I'm gonna go ahead and put that in there and push it in as far as I can. And it says to practice on a piece of paper. And usually I would be adventurous, but today I wanna be careful. So I'm gonna turn it. So this is when it's off. Oh, no, it's not off. Oh my Okay, 
Okay, all right, right, right. Oh my gosh, it's dribbling. Okay, that is actually really cool. But let me get you guys a little, even closer so we can see what's going on. So we're gonna start off with the pink and we're gonna start it off right here. So let's go. one side for now so we've done that let's remove the pink oh my gosh I've lost the cap oh there it is so let's put this back on so it doesn't dry out or anything and now we're gonna grab our purple next here we go and we're gonna place that right in here again all right there we go and we're gonna do the same thing and now it's gonna go all the way to the middle so <laughs> So I wanted it to look like a gradient, so I was kind of starting to go over the pink a little bit. Um, I wish it came out, you have to get quite close. There we go. So <laughs> let's see how this is gonna come out. This is gonna be a hot mess, isn't it? So let's do blue now. So we're gonna grab the blue. Put that right in there. There we go. Oh, oh my gosh! Okay, the blue is really coming out. Ooh, who knew I would be so talented? Okay, so, so far I have to say, this is actually quite fun. I am really, really enjoying this right now. So far I have to say, oh, it scares me every time. <laughs> okay. Able, it comes with like this little, like the little logo here. So I'm gonna use this one here and we could put it right in that corner where I messed up. So it's like a cover up, you know? Like, oh, I didn't mess up, what you talking about? So now that we've done that, you grab your little clip right here and then, is it dry? I think so, yeah, it is dry. So it says, with your fingers, Pinch to gather the ribbon fabric towards the middle. Okay, so it's like this. So you're almost, you're pinching it like you would a ribbon, but you go like this. There we go. And then you hold it. And let's clip it like that. Oh my gosh! Okay, doesn't that actually look quite good? I am really surprised with this. Okay, so, so far it's actually quite good. So we could add different stencils and I might add a stencil, but I'm wondering if I should save the dye for my actual hair. But I'm wondering if I should also add like a little, like maybe like a little star or something like right here. We could add just one plain star in the back just to see what it looks like. And then I have my Jojo Boba. Oh, and trust me, I'm gonna try it out. I am definitely gonna try it out. So I am gonna go ahead and do a tiny little star. Okay, it's kind of working. I mean, to be honest, it just looks like a blob. And I just kind of almost ruined my bow. So I'm not gonna do that again because my bow is perfect. Okay, so now that we've done that, we're still gonna try the stencil in a little bit. I'm gonna go ahead and grab my hair extension, which I am going to use with my Jojo Bobo. Um, so let's kind of like spread this out a little bit. And for the colors on this one, I think we're gonna kind of go for the same one that Jojo has. 
I want to use mostly these two colors to make it. So let's go ahead, maybe some purple. Let's do some purple as well. Maybe the green as well. So make sure we put that in there. All right, so we're going to do kind of like little swirls. We're just going to do like little sections. All right, so here's the problem. I don't know if there's actually any left in there. I mean, you could still use it as a marker so you could kind of see that it does, but it just, nothing will come out. So what I'm gonna try to do is I'm gonna try to leave this upside down a little bit and see if any more comes out. So now I'm gonna switch to the blue. So that's it for the blue as well. As you can see, I just feel like it's not giving you a lot of color. Like they run out very quickly. So as fun as it is, the joy is kind of done within a little bit of time because it's like there's no more color left. You can go ahead and slide um, this part of the clip in. Let's go ahead. Yeah, there we go. And then, of course, you could just close it. So I have never put this in my hair before. So, and there's really no instructions for it. So I'm going to try my best right now without a mirror. <laughs> this is going to be so great. Oh, my gosh. Okay, how is that? Oh my gosh, okay, wait, wait, ow, 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 uh, okay, hold up a second. We're having some technical difficulties. All right, I think I've got it. Oh my gosh, I think that took about 20 minutes. Oh my gosh, I'm never doing this again. Okay, so that was the most difficult part of this whole DIY kit is getting the bow on my head while I'm in a bed. All my little baby hair is like freaking out right now. Okay, it's okay now, we can breathe. Now I gotta put this on. Oh my jeebus, okay. <laughs> this will not work if you've got long hair. <laughs> okay, we're gonna try to be adventurous with this. We're gonna try our best. Okay, so it has that little clip right here, you know, which goes like this and it goes into your hair. So let's unclip this and then I think it's just kind of like, we're gonna put it inside of our ponytail. So we like almost partially hides it. And then like, what is that? <laughs> it looks like I've got just some gray hair, which I do and that's fine. I guess what we could do is like dye just that one part right there. I mean. <laughs> Yes, we're <laughs> I don't even know what this video is anymore, okay? So now what we're gonna try to do, okay, well, let's just try to let's hook that back in there, okay? Let's just, just try to put that back in there. All right, so what we're gonna try to do now is, why is her ponytail like so good? Like how come she gets that side pony like perfect? Mine looks like a hot mess. All right, so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna grab our little machine right here and I'm gonna try to literally grab like a strand of my hair and just like boop, okay? So we're gonna grab the pink and we're gonna test out the pink first and see if that works. Now, I don't know how I'm gonna do this without getting it everywhere. So maybe I should grab some paper. This is gonna be bad. Is it even coming out? Is it even coming out? Nothing even happening right now. I was getting angry for no reason. What? Oh my God. My life, what is going on? Okay. I'm about to try a heart stencil. Like right there. Right there. I just feel air. 
Nothing else. This is not even working. I mean, like, what is life right now? Yellow will not show up at all. So that's not gonna work. Let's try the blue. All right, you see that? Yes, girl, work that. Let's try this again. It's not doing anything. All right, so I think um, it's safe to say that to make the bows, it's cool, you know? But like for everything else, not really, because you don't get enough dye for your hair and it ends up still just looking like plain white hair. And with this dye, it definitely doesn't work with your hair. I know it doesn't say to try this, but like it still works. It still, it still has ink, which you can see. You won't be able to see the yellow. Blue still there. There's pink. And the purple. So you still have a bit of like color left in there. But for whatever reason, like the machine will just not like get any color out. So if you're just looking to make the heck is that? My little sticker came off. My little JoJo brand. Oh. Okay, there we go. So if you're looking to just make like a cute bow. Even though you could just go out and buy your own bow and I think they're cheaper, I personally think it's fun. Like if you had a couple friends over, you each had your little kit, it would be a lot of fun. And like, I don't know, I, I definitely think it's a fun experience. Now, just know going into it, look at this, look at this. I, I need Jojo to teach me her ways. Um, if you have dark hair, these are definitely not gonna work on your hair. Like honestly, I feel like the only way these will work on your hair is if you have blonde hair. If you have anything darker than that, it's not gonna work. Now the bows themselves are really nice. The only thing is I wish they gave you two of the little clip things because they do give you two ribbons and you can change it, you can replace it, but it's like, just give you two. So I do think it's worth it. I do think it's fun. Like if I had a daughter and stuff and she was like, oh, I like Jojo, I would definitely buy it for her because like I said, it's cool. It's fun making them. Like that's the funnest part of all of this is making the cute little bow and getting to just play around with the colors. And another thing is, I, I just wish they gave just more product in these. Because if they did, it would be so much fun. Like, you realistically can't really decorate this now. Because you don't have enough color left to decorate this with. Unless, let's try something. All right, so what I did is I grabbed this as like just the marker. And I used the stencil. And I colored in the heart. But with that, it kind of takes the fun of using this. Because you could just grab a marker and do it. Now, for this same thing, I feel like it's not really worth it if you don't have enough product to dye the hair because like I was trying to look like Jojo. That's what I was trying to like recreate right now. So I do think it's fun. I do think it's worth it. I would like, like I said, if I had a daughter or like a niece or something and I thought she would like this, I would definitely get it for them. I think it would be fun to do together and stuff. So definitely worth it in that sense. But anyway, you guys, my wee, has been snatched. Oh my gosh, my bow. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and end it here. I'm sorry, this is a hot mess. I hope you guys just take this lighthearted. It was a lot of fun. Let me know if there's anything else you would like me to review. Another kit. It could be anything now. Look, we set the boundaries now. We could do bows, we could do slimes, whatever you want. Let me know in the comments down below. I hope you guys had fun watching. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and share, and I will see you guys next time. Yes. I'm gonna come back with a boomerang.